Yep. Burp, burp. Yeah, so it was a koala video. And apparently they're... I don't want to say they're like squirrels, but I suppose people can just find them hanging out in trees in Australia. And there were these two koalas, and one was much larger than the other, kept throwing the small koala out of the tree that they're in. And these are small trees, probably only 10 feet tall at most or something. Maybe, maybe like 13 feet tall. The the... And the small koala was just like, Mwah! And koalas so are dumb upset. as shit, though. <laughs> like poor koalas. You've, you, you know, like. Yeah, they're diseased. Well, not not just diseased though. It's like a multitude of things. They apparently have like the smoothest brains of any mammal. Really? Yeah, um, or something like that. Like so they don't have any folds to hold. No, knowledge. they're they're actually like beyond just being drugged out. They're, what is it? Overly it's, promiscuous. Yeah, overly promiscuous, have chlamydia, <laughs> uh, can starve to death. If they Be don't eat enough. Well, it's not even that they don't, it's not even like a if they don't eat enough thing, it's like a... Their if, diet isn't conducive to... Well, don't they only eat one thing, or is as that As babies, they have to eat their parents' shit. Oh. To develop the correct enzymes to break down the, uh, the to break down the eat. eucalyptus because they normally don't have the correct uh, correct enzymes to do so, and so, and this frequently happens. Apparently, all the mothers will just like ditch their young, and there's nothing you can do. Did they just die? Yeah, uh. they just die. How do I get up here? Cause I get up here, but. No, nah, that mushroom doesn't seem to... I want to get up this section because it's bothering me. Because I don't know where the rest of the pumpkins are, so I was assuming maybe around one of these zones? Too tired? Yeah, I'm starting to fade unless I like get a tea or something else. Well, you want to make Thai know. tea for both of us while I try and figure out how to platform? Not Thai tea. Thai tea is a little bit thick. Make me Thai tea. You can make yourself whatever you want. You're I just want Thai tea. You're going to have all the Thai tea. Yeah? Because, oh. I mean, I'm going to be doing platforming stuff for a second anyway. Is I going to figure out... Oh. Unless there's a... Uh... Is there another way up here? Oh, there's an alternate way up that's higher. So I just have to figure out how to get there. And I've already been through this zone, so this is doable. Yeah, go make us some tea, Shell. I have a sore throat anyway. Tea me! Well, you're probably tired too. Yeah, this is this is what I'm supposed to do. Uh or not? Oh. I'm not supposed to be higher than this. How the butts? It looks like you could almost go along this section here. But there's no way to get higher than I currently am. So I have to... I have to come at this from this side. Okay. Unless there's a secret way up via the seared lake. I got it. So we want to go over, up, and around. Wow. That's awkward. Okay, because we can go up here. 
probably cross the mushrooms. I'm assuming... Top of the zone? Oh. Father. Yeah, so this is the top of the zone. Okay. There's a very no normal looking mushroom. Yeah. I don't know why people keep talking about these mushrooms. Okay. I'm back here, but this isn't immediately, or maybe it is helpful. Maybe this is the right way. It looks... This looks right. Okay, so we're up high. Now, just to not screw it up. Okay, there we go. Is that it? <laughs> is that really all I, had, I can do in this area? Holy... Crap, yeah, it is. Wow. This is a thing. Now, I'm assuming there's only one area left in this game after this point. Just Sapphire Ridge? And then whatever post-game content they have snuck around the game? Or are there more regions after Sapphire Ridge? Okay, so now we can get up over here. Which means I can get the shortcut. Hallelujah. Let's me get up and around here, over here, up this. Let's me get this. Okay. Nothing there. But go back around. I still haven't found any more of those pumpkins. It must be in a lower area. It'd be kind of nice if we had a quest marker uh, pointing at them, honestly. Uh, Ellie Ho? Oh! There it is! Okay. There we go. Okay. I knew it. I knew there'd be... Too big? Too big. Okay. Let me get this here. We grab that. We get this open. Okay, so we're we're at six out of seven. Does anybody know where the last one is? Just so I don't spend the rest of the night looking for the oogie boogie uh, pumpkin. Cause I don't I don't mind looking around, but I could use a pointer if I'm in the right area or not. This is there's a lot here. Okay, so we're back over here. There's nothing this way. I guess we can go... Through there. It looks like a, there's a path that direction. Never finish this quest. Ah. Maybe I can jump from that side. Over.
Yeah. Okay, so that's how I get over here. No! How'd that... How, what? Oh. Or not. Oh, dang it. Man, perspective is hard. Okay, so we want to drop over here. Probably just fling myself at this one? No, how the deuce are you supposed to do this? Unless... No, actually, you're just supposed to go around the corner here. Yeah. Okay, I got it. I don't think this is where the pumpkin is. But at least it's a thing I can get to. And then I'm going to get immediately distracted and go to this direction instead. Because there's something else over here. Spicy beta types. Hmm. Let me guess. Yep, didn't work. Okay, so we'll try the other one. Uh huh. Okay. Up and around, jump over. Jump over to this, here, here, here. And then we loop around, We go, and then we can do, go down. Okay. Still no pumpkin, though. I've been pretty thorough in this area. Alright, next one. Guess we might as well kill the show cats. Alright, I'm back. I'm just killing show cats and platforming. Around regular mushrooms. Oh, hey! Look, there's a square mushroom. I don't know what you're talking about. That's the perfectly regular mushroom. Hmm. Okay, virus. No, that's not what I'm looking for. I really liked it when we had the mushroom beef tacos. Yeah. Could have been a little, like, more savory for me. Mm. They were sweet. Oh, well, the taco sauce recipe called for some sugar. I don't know about sugar in taco anything. Okay. I'll keep that in mind in the future. I don't know. I guess it's just like I, I'm so used to savory flavors in almost all my cooking. It's real bizarre when it's well, not. Well, in Thai cooking, like the curries, they ask for sugar. I... Yeah. But that's like Thai cooking. It, so it's mainly the difference of a something, you know, I've had before. Mm -hmm. I guess. And something I haven't. So, like, I've had a lot of, you know, fajita burrito, seasoning, meats, whatever. Yeah. The only reason why I added sugar the last time was because that's what the specific taco sauce recipe called for. And I'm like, huh, I'll try it this time. Usually I just put in a little bit of cayenne, a little bit of chili pepper, a little bit of paprika, cumin, thyme. Italian seasoning. But this one had called for a little bit of sugar and a little bit of... Oh, what else? Where the heck is the pumpkin? Oh. The hives are back. Really? Yep, they've oh. regrown. So I should probably grab that. Uh. Oh, all the show cats are after you. Yeah, happens. I don't think they're actually aggro. They just kind of walk around towards you and then zap you, because they're little jerks. Okay. Please give me the thing I need. I think that's it. Yes, yep. Royal Hive. Yep. Okay. Yeah, what you need. Well, one of the things I need. I'm still trying to figure out where the last pumpkin is. You know, it's probably actually in this area. I don't re recall exploring this area that much. Probably in, like, an upper area, or... Hmm. Pumpkin! Fight me! Oh. Hmm. Hi? There it is! Nope. Yes! Finally! It appeared. 
I've been waiting for so long. What kind of things would you carve into pumpkins? I wouldn't. You've never carved pumpkins? I don't think so. What? Remember, my parents hate waste. So carving a pumpkin would be wasteful. I suppose Maybe? they they wouldn't want to to toast seeds. I'm pretty sure they would. You know, because my parents would just throw out the seeds. Also, you're getting shocked. Yeah. By a show cat. A little. Okay, so that's that's it for this area. We've explored much of the zone. I only have a third of the chests and loot. Ah, I'm probably not going to grab all of them, but we've got at least a bunch of the quests done. Yeah, we would tend to do jack-o'-lantern faces, but I think once or twice I had done... It's kind of like an illustration, but it was more of just wolf howling at the moon. That kind of business. Okay. Oh. Hi. I see you've collected the flames. Terrific. Things are almost ready then. The only thing we need to do is a test run. Huh? Tiny one, can I count on your help once again? Mm hmm Spooktacular. I'll be inside constructing everything. It'll only take a ghost of a second. Just follow me inside when you're ready. I really can't do an Oogie Boogie voice. Nor does it matter that much. Well, well Oogie Boogie. Yeah, yeah, welcome to Pumpkin Funland. Please enter the teleporter to start your ride. We. Ooh. Creepy. It's like a haunted mansion. Blue. I wish to fight. Button. Oh, I see. Now they're gonna fight me. There it is. There we go. I'm surprised there's no, like, special song for this area. Considering they've yeah. got a giant reference to... Night Before, before Christmas. Maybe I, just I thought have he to had wait. a big jazz tune, didn't he? Oogie Boogie? Uh. I don't. You know, I don't actually remember. I don't. The re problem is, I played Kingdom Hearts recently. Mm hmm. Which kind of infects my brain as far as, like, remembering how any of the music goes. Yeah, unfortunately, the only. Whoa. Interesting. We got spooked. The songs that I remember most from oh. Nightmare Before Christmas are, I mean, the, This is Halloween, and Jack's Lament, and Sally's song, and then the final version where Sally and Jack sing together for their song. Okay, help me remember my way. It's a spoop maze. Oh, okay. He's going to... Uh. Okay. Never mind. Wasn't much of a. Dang it! Oh, you went the wrong way again. Oh no! No, it teleported you. I the think crack. it was. Okay. Oh, it didn't work. Or maybe it did. I'm not sure. It's weird that there's no music though. Mhm. Mm not a big deal. Just weird. Ow! Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Might want to heal up. Oh, that sweet health back. Blow up at right, Emily. Kyle, she can don't... take it. I am... I am a delicate ouch. Final boss room? Yep. Oh. Terrific. Just terrific. Tiny one, it seems you've already had a... had great fun in Pumpkinland. Ah. Uh. Alas, we're not done yet. And now it's time for the grand finale. What? <laughs> bugs! Why does it have to be bugs? What are they weak to? The answer is ice. Holy crap, they are weak to ice. They're just throwing more pumpkins at us. No, it has to be bugs. Come to me and die. <laughs> Wee! Kill, Kill them! Kill them with fire! No, wait! 
Ice! Ow. Kill them whoa, with whoa, ice! Whoa, 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 Hi. Oh, it's Ow. because they're fire ants, so you need ice. Yeah, clearly. Oh dang, I'm just gonna switch back to this for a second. Well, we wait for everything to recover. Give me all that HP back, that is not Stop much HP. Just die already! Alright, because Oogie Boogie was also full of insects, wasn't he? He was a creepy call it yeah, crawly sack. Dude was a dude was a giant sack of bugs. I like this move. The homing ice bounce shot is nuts. I like it. Wonderful. Wasn't that just great? Hmm. Well, I sure had plenty of fun, tiny one. It's hard enough to haunt anybody in the city, with everyone so busy. So I knew I had to aim for something big and start a proper business. Uh. It's the only way to get any attention these days. Well, I sure call this a success. Thanks a lot for your participation, tiny one. Bye. That's a weirdly friendly oogie boogie. Mm -hmm. Great. I, when I had we, I thought I was safe from these things in that temple mine. Oh, Past the temple mine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got the spook crown. The scare crown. Okay. What? So, flash step. Duration of invincibility when dashing. But everything else gets to be 20%. Drop rate. Less. That's tough. I don't... It just doesn't seem to be an upgrade it's, to me. It's a farming item. Um, it looks like. Like you're supposed to, uh... You're supposed to farm... Items. Because that plus the Giga Drill plus like a couple other things. And your drop rate's probably quite high on grabbing resources. Helpful for me, I guess. Sort of? Eh. Okay, so next up we have Dr. Cretia, Woodland Vanguard, and Mystique. Okay, so sure. that's that's Woodland Vanguard, right? No. Now, ah. is it, isn't she the one with stake? So it shouldn't it be Ms. Stake? Yeah. Sorry. But I don't know. Hi! Seeker, you're back. Seems like we finally made some progress thanks to you. Hmm. The experts on site still need to properly open that door, but it's only a matter of time. You didn't mix this tea. I did mix it. Not very I well. think there was one thing in the top that didn't mix, and you must have just gotten it. It's like hard candy made out of tea. <laughs> Partially dissolved in tea. <laughs> Hey, how does this sound? Once we make progress, we'll work together again, eh? Oh! Mm-hmm. Great. I will send out a request over the Seeker Hub once we're ready. Hope to see you again. Bye! Oh, wow, we are overleveled. Oh, and we got the follow-up already. Ah, Seeker. Nice seeing you again. Still interested in the temple excavation, I assume? Uh, mm-hmm. Well, of course you are. And we got some great news for you on that front. The door has been opened. Oh. We are now just about to plug into the track's energy circuits from the temple that lies beyond it. But, for that, we will need someone to lead the defenses again. How about it? Got some free time in your schedule? Mm-hmm. All right. Reliable as before, I see. Oh. Reliable as before, I see. Let's hope that that's also true for that tech you will be using again. Huh. That defensive system from last time got a bit of an upgrade that should be working about the same. Oh. Mm-hmm. Go back to the grubby cave on Calm Backyard. Really? It's called Calm Backyard? Yep. And go through the door inside. We already got some of our colleagues inside that can fill you in on the details. Mm -hmm. Bye. Yeah, goodbye. 
and good luck. Okay, so we still have to do a promise is a promise. Raising the stakes. I have no idea where the broken deck is. We'll find that as we go along. So, Guy's Garden cross go Crossroad. Oh, Talatu Lips in Baki Kum. Uh. Well, why don't we hand things into the sort of horticulturist people that really like the environment? Uh, did we already? I think we already did that one. Well, why does it still have a quest thing that says that it's fulfilled? No, we've already we've already done that one. Hmm. I think we've already done that one. We do want to find Henry here. Where is Henry? Oh, so shouldn't Henry be at the very beginning since he's the one that? Yeah, gives he's somewhere you... in the crossroad. Oh, isn't he in a cave? This most recent time. Oh, uh, he's in this he's in this zone. And there's no cave in this zone. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um Oh. I don't think we ever found that. Hmm? Oh, there's a teleport point right there. I see. Which we've never used. I don't see anything useful here. Maybe he's up and over? I don't see him at all. I thought he was inside a cave. Oh. Oh, who's that? Oh, it's this guy, Baxton, the guy that was looking for the dude. Oh, right. Lady Leah. Hi. It seems we meet yet again. It must be fate. Huh. Reports in this area have been made by dutiful players that strange player was seen here. One that appears as a humble NPC seeking help from other players. Let me ask quite bluntly here, Lady Leah. Did you accept a quest from an NPC by the name of, let me see here, Henry? Mm-hmm. Well, this is quite unsettling. You are the third person to report so. I fear we have a person with malicious intent here. Hmm. Ah, fear not, Lady Leah. I do not believe you are involved in such shady business. I must, however, follow procedure and file a report against this player. Even if it is highly provable that Henry is just a cover name. For now, I'll manually complete the quest that has been given to you. I'm following a lead that will take me all the way to Sapphire Ridge. May we meet again under more pleasant circumstances next time, Lady Leah. Goodbye. Bye. Alright, so that's just a thousand EXP. Nice. That gets us a free So level. I suppose that's why you couldn't find him. Yep. Okay, so we want to do Grubby Cave Calm Backyard. Calm Backyard. We're just going to finish up all these side quests okay. and then we'll move on. That sounds good. Because that way we can finish up uh, the dungeon tomorrow or I guess whenever we play next might not be tomorrow. Mm -hmm. It'll probably be day after tomorrow. We'll alternate. Okay. That sounds fine. Because I would like to try and push to finish this game within the, within the next couple of days. Well, seeing as how after this area it's that Sapphire Ridge that everyone keeps referring to the place where Shizuka f found her brother oh. at the very beginning. It might take a while. I'm not expecting it's going to be quick. Mm -hmm. And we'll probably have to take at least one Diablo break. Yeah. But, like, I think we're good on Pokemon for a while. Oh. Yeah, we were looking into the uh, Pokeball edition that you can use to get Mew. And it was $50? Yeah, 50 bucks. It's, but I it's mean, also a pedometer and can be used with Pokemon Go and a bunch of other things, but... Huh. Hmm? Hmm? Hi? Ah, there you are, Lit Seeker. Good to see that you finally arrived. I already finished the preparations a while ago. Ooh. Well, let's not stand around here wasting time. I'll be waiting for you on standby at the machine. Mm hmm Now, I should probably... Save. Uh, saving or is important. upgrade. I want to make sure I'm getting the right stuff. I'm not, necessarily. 
actually would be quite helpful. But I wanted to go for this, because attack power by 10% is actually pretty good. Hi. Okay. There you are. So I guess we can finally push to the last hurdle. This should be similar to last time you helped us out, so just let me give you a short rundown. Hmm? Here we have our new and improved track power extraction device. It will drain the mystical energy of the track from this position of power and save it for later use. Ooh. Of course, as you'd expect, starting the extraction will provoke hordes of monsters to attack us. Yeah, typical track tantrums, am I right? In any case, you'll have to defend it, Seeker. Though this time, those sly beasts will come from two paths at once. Ah, all the more reason to use your amazing turret defenses grid again. Well, defense grid again. Yeah, this is a defense grid reference. Mm -hmm. That's cool. You just gotta hit them a few times before activating them with charge attack, just like last time. Well, you should get how this works by now. Just talk to me again once you want to start. All right, let's start it up. Okay, just more instructional stuff. All right, now activate the other turret on the left so we can start properly. The first wave incoming from the left side. As before, those shields will reflect damage, so just wait for the neutral turrets to get rid of them. Also, I've also activated the heat and cold turrets. You can still activate them with charge shot for their respective element. But don't forget that only neutral turrets can break shields. Attention Seeker, we also got hostiles incoming on the right side now. Oh, there's fun little jump pads. Yeah, crazy good jump pads. Well, I suppose you're up against show cat. Yep. Okay. Good job, Seeker. Seems like they'll be coming- uh, Blah. They will continue to attack from both sides at once. I will now activate your new shock and wave elemental turrets. As usual, activate them with a charge shot of their respective element. Right side incoming. You also have a lot of turrets that need activating too. Oh, left side incoming. Yep, gonna have to deal with the show cats first. Ah, they bounce me out of the way. I'm probably gonna have to. Oops, okay. slimes. Oh no, they're getting in, aren't they? Almost. Come on! Oh, you can't- Come on! Barrier damaged! That's stupid that the- The bouncy bit doesn't allow you to go to the middle. Yeah. Uh, well, no, it's not that it was to the middle. I was getting body blocked by the slime, so I couldn't even get over to the other side. Oh, enemies are weak to shock on the left? Yeah. And what on the right? Wave on the right. Mm -hmm. It, it's just kind of frustrating. The uh, some of the design stuff was, you know, I like these turrets, but it wasn't letting me get around mm -hmm. the way I wanted it to, and so. Whoa! Something big is approaching from the right. There we go. Okay. Maybe you put a wave on that one. Okay. What was that? What was a bowl? What is it weak to? It is weak to wave from behind. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems to have little conductor horns. Yep. Look, okay, so it's... What? What was that? You got teleported. Using the, the pad. 
It was just awkward. Fourth group incoming. Again from both sides. Hang in there. Okay. I'm kind of over turreting one side versus the other. Uh, let's see. I have just enough energy. Okay. Wants jolt. Yeah, so the, I think it, part of it is the enemies bump into you mm -hmm. and counter all of my combos. Oh. Because there's so many bouncing off of them. Yeah. Oh. Right side incoming? Oh. There we go. That's confusing. And obnoxious. Well, you got rid of those cats. Yeah, the show cats aren't actually that dangerous. I, I think we're going to be probably fine. Ow. It's just uh, a little bit frustrating trying to get her get around here sometimes. Dang, I'm getting a ton of energy readings. Seems like they're mounting a huge last assault. I'll put out all the turrets we got left. Make them count. Come on. Next. Okay, do we have any more there? The answer is no. Have any more? Not enough energy. Oh. oh. Now we do. There's also some right incoming. Yep. See, that that was the combo that I was attempting to do. Oh, you might want to check on the right side. Yep. Oh, it's just a... I mean, there's a bowl. Yeah. Oh, cool. I can stop the pull with my body. Mm -hmm. It looks like the turrets are handling like 90% of it. Which is kind of nice. Mm -hmm. Except for the bulls. The bulls are the problem. They're a little beefy. Huh? Arr. Arr. What was that? Oh no. What was that? Something damaged you. It knocked me back when I was in the middle of the uh, me sucking them in. And knocked me in the hole. Defense successful. Well, it worked. It was just awkward. Really awkward. Love up. And done. Nice work, Seeker. Come back for a sec- Um, to me for a second so we can finish this off. Okay. Well, well. Will you look at that? Seeker, our machine is running smoothly as, and has already gathered lots of ancient energy. Truly a fantastic piece of tech, this baby. Moments like this make all the trouble seem worth it. Hmm. Hi? Oh, yeah. You also did fine. This operation would have been difficult without your protection. So thanks. Uh. So yes. Report back to our HQ to get your reward. And until next time. Uh, bye. Okay, so I think we're done with that area. These AI seem to be better at gauging emotions and stuff. If they're if they're well, actually they did say AI, are they people? They were getting more advanced. Yeah. Hi. Oh, hey. The seeker makes her heroic return after once again taming the wild. Hmm. Yes, you did a good job indeed, and an important one. Replacing that device would have set us back for weeks if it broke. But now we can siphon that sweet, precious track energy and also extract more information for future missions. Mm hmm. Hopefully, we can count on you again in the future, Seeker. Mm hmm. See you around. Bye. Okay, circuits. I have some leveling to do. I need to remember to use this move. Throw art. You're too tired. Yeah, is it alright if we stop for now? Yeah, we can stop. Do we, do we finish this? I guess we have. I mean, I suppose if we meet up with the lab lady, maybe the next arc won't start? What do you think? Uh... I'm not sure. Because we need to 
complete the research with her so that the shad will leave the tree so that we can enter the tree so that we can commune with it for some reason. So There's like a third dungeon. Sounds like it's going to be a thing. Trying to decide what I want to invest in. Realistically, re increasing my elemental resistance would probably be prudent. Oh, decreases the damage taken when guarding by 32%. Might actually be worth saving up for. Let's see. Actually, I think I'm gonna go down this direction. The status mend is way more helpful than knockback. Uh, Shell, we why don't we why don't we pick this up next time? Yeah, I'm I'm starting to close my eyes, just going hmm. Yeah, you you are non-functional. All right. Should I just say good night? I don't know if you're going to turn this off or yeah. just keep showing this. I am just uh very quickly zipping through what level what level nonsense I can. Mm -hmm. Cause there's there's a lot of little perks that I can kind of pick up rather quickly. That'll make uh, each one of these trees better. Can I get this? Yes! Slows down elemental overload by another 30%. Oh, nice. Which I think means I can just stay in this mode for like a while. Mm -hmm. uh, it's still kind of slow. I wonder if there's something that gets the additional 10%. Uh, uh, buh, 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 buh. Okay, the only other thing I want to check is... We're going to go back up here. I want to check this. Yep. Hmm? We have more quests in the area. Ah. Yeah, stolen crates in the roof rooftop. Uh, we can go get the the refrigerators. And corrupted plants are threatening Guy's garden. A level 47. What level am I? 48. Yeah, we're over-leveled. And we'll continue to be so for the rest of this series. 